Yeah. Uh, yeah. Hi. Hello. Welcome to the currently on name podcast. Don't want to, that's actually your, your title, isn't it? <laughs> yeah, that's actually my other podcast. <laughs> uh, welcome to a podcast that the name is being voted on currently. By you. By you. Go to our socials to find the find the vote. So we thought in the meantime, we could do some introductory um, uh, episodes because you know me, but you don't know me that well. And we don't know Sam at all. Hmm. Um, so we've both written 20 questions for each other. Yep. And I think this one is going to be you interviewing me. Yep. Start and then the next one, I'll interview Sam. And then after that, we'll be full podcast, all guns are blazing with the new name. Right. Go ahead, Sam. So 20 questions. You, um, we had a chat about this before and I asked how rude could I be? Um, yeah, because I do like to be naughty sometimes. You do. Uh, if you look you? at any of my, I, all my jokes are penis or bumhole related on my own account. He can start a TikTok about anything and it ends with a fart or a penis. <clears throat> yeah, it doesn't go down well with brands. Um, <laughs> but we'll start with a few simple ones to begin with. Yeah. Um, for those that aren't familiar with Fred and follow me, uh, a lot of you. <laughs> <laughs> Number one, what's your full name? Are you asking me this because you know this and you're trying to take the piss? Is that what it is? No. I've got a middle name that I hate. Oh, I didn't know this. Good question. Great question. Frederick Mark. That's not the one I hate. Norrison. (laughs) (laughs) All right, calm down. (laughs) Wait, how many have you got? You're going to keep going. (laughs) Frederick Mark Norrison Asquith. Mate, it's a banging name. It's all right, isn't it? It sounds very grand. Yeah, really grand. I have to say it. Some Frederick. women in my past have found it a turn on. That Norris. Name. Norrison. Norrison. <laughs> Norrison. <laughs> Norris sounds, it sounds, like it sounds very posh. Yeah. Frederick Mark Norrison Asquith. Yeah, I'm not I'm not a fan of Norrison. Would you if you ever well, when, sorry, when you're in the films, yeah. Uh, and the credits come up, this isn't a question, this is twenty one questions okay, now with yeah, Fred. Yeah. Um would you have that as your full stage name? I think that It'd I would take have... up the whole cinema. I do. I think I do. <laughs> Needs to be on one of those wraparound screens. Yeah. I think I do a J.K. Rowling and I have Fred, Frederick M. N. Asquith. Nice. You know what I mean? Yeah. Well, who who does that? Uh, Michael B. Jordan. I'd be like that. Yeah. You know what I mean? Yeah. More Next question, please. Next question. Again, keeping these quite tame to begin with. Using only your face. Mm. What does your penis look like when you wake up in the morning? <laughs> yeah, like, like that. Like yeah. Stuck. Really, really hard. I always got hard on in the morning. Oh right. Every okay. time. Every time. If I don't, mine is. I like... got something in my eye. I think I just nearly passed <laughs> out. Mine is like you know it's on your leg. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Man, I'm <laughs> boiling next to this radiator, and now I've just done that face. I'm so boiling. Um, Making you nervous with these questions. Yeah. Uh, no, it, it, I've always got a, a stiffy. Nice. Yeah. Good to know. Um, won't be showing your bed. What, <laughs> number three, what do you want to be when you grow up? Mm, nice one. My ideal job, I'm going to answer it seriously. Yeah, do, please. I've has always been, I just want to be a fucking daytime TV presenter. Yeah, mate, you'd be so good. I want to be on like this morning, like yeah. with Holly Willoughby, just or whatever, or the one show. I always just thought I'd be good at that. Fucking Blue Peter. Some bullshit. Yeah. Man. Yeah. No, you'd be banging it. I think I'd be good at a situation where you're not allowed to be explicit, mm. but you know that someone's on the edge of being explicit all the time. Yeah. I think that's what my the, vibe is. For the parents. Yeah. 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 Next one. No, good. Very good. Number four was, do you have a middle name? But we'll count. We'll, we'll, we'll what, you that. had two name <laughs> questions? You, wait, you had a full <laughs> name and then do you have a middle name? I don't, I don't think I, uh, I spell. I checked this one. Uh, number five. <laughs> Do you have any siblings? Yes. I have three siblings, all older than me. Nice. Yes. Next question. <laughs> okay, quest, back to question four. What genders are your siblings? Uh, one is non-binary. Two are female. Question six. Are any of them single? <laughs> <laughs> yes. One is single. Two are essentially married. One's fiancé, but essentially okay. married. The other one is single. Well, yes. Well noted. Rude, <laughs> but I have to answer. Yes. Yeah, yeah. well noted. 
number seven, if you had to describe your job in a sentence to a drunk girl in a smoking area, what would you I say? I mean, we do this all the time. Yeah, you, you've got practice. Okay, well, I actually work in marketing, which is the dead... I mean, every girl walks away when you say that. Mm -hmm. So I always just say I work for YouTube. Mm. Because I, I don't, but like I work with YouTube. So yeah. I just say, oh, I work for YouTube. And with the TikTok stuff, if they haven't already mentioned it, I'd never mention that. Mm -hmm. I wouldn't say oh, I make TikTok videos. Cause I think it's a bit of an ick. TikTok is an ick. And when, when people think TikTok, they think you're going... Exactly. And also, if I say I make TikToks and they haven't seen me, then they think... Oh well, he's shit it. <laughs> yeah, yeah. And if they, if they spend loads of time on it, they're like, he's not come up on my phone. Exactly. Babe. And if I try and make out that I'm doing all right at it, they're like, oh god, like he thinks he's really yeah. good. It's really awful. So yeah, don't don't mention it. Like that girl in the smoking area the other night. Yeah, you know who you are. Uh, number eight. How tall are you really? Yeah. Um. So I say I'm six foot four. Mm -hmm. And I'm actually six foot four. Next question, Sam. <laughs> in shoes, six five. Uh huh? In like boots, if you wore boots. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Mate, Ooh. I've got some trainers. Make me like six six, I swear. Yeah. It, you're in a pure gym, six six or seven eight. Honestly, I'm, yeah. I'm shitting myself. <laughs> yeah. I'm 193 centimeters. Uh, question nine, which I think is an important one with, with, for your audience. What's your sexual preference? What's that mean? What, what do you mean? What do you look? Which way do you swing? Oh, I thought you, you meant were like, thinking like I thought you meant like position. <laughs> um, I, I like I'm it. straight. Yeah, a lot of people. I mean, the majority of people on social media think mm. I'm gay. I think it's because I've done delivery memes where I'm posing like this. And to be honest, it's stereotyping the gay community. Sam, just because I'm feminine doesn't mean that I have to be gay. True. Correct. Correct. So um, I'm not gay. I'm straight. Thanks for asking. No worries. You're going to lose a lot of followers. <laughs> <laughs> Question we'll cut it out. 10. How old were you when you lost your virginity? Oh, yeah. I and was how did it go? 17. And it was like, it was with a long-term girlfriend. Good. Um, long-term long because at, of it? Or? At the time. Oh, wow. Been, okay. been together about six months, I think, at the time. Oh, if, wow. If you're watching, let me know. Um, <laughs> and it, it went fine. Yeah. Yeah. Like, uh, we just did missionary and, yeah, it lasted like two minutes and... But it wasn't awkward Good. because we had already done other stuff together. Nice. It's not a very fun story. That no, was a very polite one. Yeah. Um, how would you describe me to a mate behind my back? Oh, mate, I do it all the time. <laughs> the guy with the tash. Oh. Every time. Just the guy with the tash. Every, and everyone knows. You actually said that to your mum on the phone the other day when yeah, I was yeah, with yeah. you. I'd say I'm with, I'm with ta uh, Sam with the Tash or TikTok Sam with the Tash. And she tash was like, Sam. bloody hell. Oh, not him again. <laughs> not again. Yeah, she's noticed I'm spending way too much time with you. <laughs> yeah, I know. Uh, yeah, the Tash. The Tash is your brand. Not the, like, I like it that you've made tash this tash about you. Been my question about <laughs> yeah, you. Know, yeah, <laughs> yeah, yeah. Uh, question 12. Yeah. Top three mm. icks on a date. Oh. If someone says, if someone takes too much time thinking about what wine to get, mm. as if it matters, yeah, I fucking hate that. I, I'm assuming we're in a restaurant on this date. Yeah, if someone's like a bit of a dick to a waiter for doing something slightly wrong, the worst. Oh, I fucking hate that. The and worst. they try and make a thing out of it, like oh, something the food's wrong, and they're like, I'm sorry, can you take it back? If someone makes a scene in a restaurant, absolutely hate that. Mm. Um, and if someone, if someone, if I take the piss out of them and yeah. they don't laugh, bye. Yeah, you have yeah. to take the piss out of yourself. Do you know what I mean? Yeah, hundred percent. I'm sorry, my answers are so tame. I like <laughs> no, having. I like it. I'm thinking of serious answers. Is that right? No, it's perfect. Right. They want to get to know you. Yeah. So do I. Um, Thirteen favorite sex position. Woo! <laughs> Me. Ah, oh, where do I start? Are we talking penetrative <clears throat> sex? Whatever you want. <sighs> not that wasn't an offer i mean Sorry. it depends it depends doesn't it because we're different people but uh, you can have vibes with different people in different okay. situations currently currently <laughs> i laugh we laugh you're... Oh, you guys like it's... <laughs> <laughs> like it's us <laughs> yeah. mate you're gonna love this one currently go on on this sofa on on the edge of this sofa with her on top nice I absolutely love it. Me sat up and sat her up. on top. Yeah. Here? Yeah. So you're sat up here. Yeah. 
No back support. I'll do it. I'll do it right now. <laughs> okay, go on. Like this. And Good she's... Ass. Yep. Good core. Good. <laughs> she's sat there. Sometimes I'm even on the edge. Like yeah, this. bloody hell. She's sat there and just... Like nice. Yeah. Not in front of the radiator, preferably. Oh, God. Every time, <laughs> man, I regret it. My back sweated. Gooch. <laughs> Swamp yeah. ass. Is it cum or is it sweat? <laughs> 14. If you were an inch inside your mum... And your dad was an inch inside of you. Where are you going? Oh, trying to remember. She's which, gonna hate trying to remember more which now. one listens to this. Yeah, God. Oh, um, I think that I would have to go backwards because I wouldn't want to go forwards. And for am I? I'm not erect inside my mum, am I? Or is that this question? Yeah, yeah. yeah. I am erect. Yeah. Yeah, so I wouldn't want to go forwards and then the stimulation, you know what I yeah. mean, made me, I don't want that. Yeah, I'd rather good. go back because I'm not really going to enjoy that and I'd be like, oh, and I'd just get off. Yeah, go back, new experiences. Yeah. Sorry, parents. Maybe be like, oh. It was the podcast's yeah. fault. Yeah. Yeah, I'd be like, oh, it's, it's actually all right. Pleasant surprise. <laughs> Stay there. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> good, good question. I think I'm the same. Not with your parents. Um, <laughs> who, this is a nice one. Yeah. Who or what do you love most on this planet? Oh, wow. Uh, is it a thing? Is it something you do? Is it a person in your family? Who something that just brings what? you the most joy every single day? Man, when I have my fucking porridge oats in the morning. Mate. Do you have porridge oats? I love them. What is it about them? Because you can do anything with them. I, they're, they're tasty. Let me be clear. Every time. Yeah. I've had them every morning since I'm a been a kid. Yeah. And like I'll never get sick of it. Yeah. I eat them with a smile on my face like a happy fucking donkey with his head <laughs> in a bucket. Like, I absolutely Even if they're love it. dry as dicks. Yeah. You just splurge some honey on top. I don't even warm them up. Do you know what? I eat them raw. Apparently that's a fucking ick for me. With, with water? No, with milk. Oh, just milk and yeah, yeah. mix it up. And oh. every, whenever I've had a girl around and they see me doing that, they're always like, oh, you eat oats raw. And I'm like, no, because they're raw in muesli, but you don't say that they're raw in muesli. Yeah, true. I'm just eating the oats. What are, you, what are your toppings? Nothing. <laughs> you just have water and oats? No, milk and oats. And milk and oats, sorry. <laughs> Soy then, milk as well. It's not even got a fatty taste to it. And like putting your family aside, the one thing that brings you most joy <laughs> on it this earth does. is... Cold, 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 cold milk and oats. I had this chat last week with my mate. I was like, if I could eat oats every meal, I would. But this is the, when you looked at me and we got excited at the beginning of this question. Yeah, I think you, I said you could do anything with them. I've seen people's oat bowls. They put like Terry's chocolate orange. They put like blueberries one side. They put chia seeds down the middle. That's yeah. what I was seeing in my head. Yeah, I didn't expect it to be. In a... Sometimes I actually think it interferes with what's really good about it. <laughs> okay. especially if i get some crunchy stuff in there like what i like about it is like when it, it's like mulch you just like <laughs> <laughs> you're a horse <laughs> <laughs> you it, just, it just tastes too good i don't want any other taste i certainly don't want something that's too sweet because what i like about it is it's both savory and sweet already yeah yeah do you put honey on it or anything no nothing a bit of creatine no, you don't. I do. What the fuck is wrong with you? <laughs> Just to keep me topped up. That's what you're mulching Three on. Grand. <laughs> Chris Gritty, Gritty. Gritty. I bloody love oats. <laughs> <laughs> oh, fuck. Right, that's next a good question. question. Good one. But you didn't think that was going to be the best one. Bloody hell, that was the best one, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Fucking hell. Um, Our laughs are going to be so distorted on yeah, these mics. Sorry. I'm so sorry. 16. Uh, what is it about Mark Zuckerberg's fashion sense that you like so much? Mo oh. oh. <laughs> <laughs> you say that dressed like that. Yeah. I only realised that halfway after I started asking, answering. Yeah, mate, minimal minimalism. Yeah, I like yeah, it. Yeah, absolutely love it. I've got a shirt, a t-shirt of every different colour in my cupboard. Gym tops, they're all pretty much the same, black or grey. And never have to think about what I'm wearing, ever. It's good. Unless I'm going to Archer Street and I'll get my turtleneck on. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Because it's a special. Yeah, occasion. true. Yeah. True. Good. Good. 17. Other than steroids and beard dye, how do you look so good? <laughs> well, thanks, mate. Yeah. Um, no beard dye. Someone said that to me the other day. 
It, well, it's because you've just grown out of Tash, but right, it's right, the same. Right. So it looks like you've just uh, got to die. Okay, right, yeah. Uh, cheers, mate. What What do you mean? What What, what about me? What do you do? like the look what do you of? Do? What about me? Do you like the look of? Well, I, I've filmed a few get ready's with me uh, uh, with you. Thanks. And you're in good nick. Thanks. I, I mean, that is the lighting of those videos. Yeah. To be clear, yeah. um, but I, I mean, I've looked the same for like five years. Mm. I'm jealous of people like you who can actually put muscle on easily. Mm. I feel like you're that type of person, right? Yeah, just eat whatever I want. Yeah, eat whatever you want, put muscle on, you stay lean. Mm. For me, like, I'm worse to both worlds. If I eat too much, I put fat on easily Mm. and I don't put muscle on easily. So Mm. it's just like, I'm just kind of, I just have to not eat very much. Mm. It's a bit annoying. You eat a lot now, like 3,000, what were you saying? Well, you said that, but I burn like 3,500 calories a day and you definitely will as well. Yeah, I need to eat more. Yeah, you really do. Do you train how often? How many days a week? I train six days a week at the moment, but usually definitely more than four days for the last like eight or nine years. So yeah. Really? But I, like I say, nothing's ever, nothing's ever changed. Like I say, <laughs> it's just like the same. Uh, this is a nice one. Nearly at the age of 30. Mm, if you months. could text your 20-year-old self, what nugget of wisdom would you give your younger, fatter, Less influential and kinky Fred. I was so chubby back then. <laughs> I would um I would say to younger I would say to twenty year old Fred get the fuck out of uni. Mm. Get out of uni. Mm. I was doing a film degree. I barely even do anything now that pulls from that at all, even when I'm filming a skit. And I'd be Just like passive aggressive direction when he's filming mine. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah. Mm, mm, I don't think that's right. Mm. Uh, well, what else would I say? I'd just be like, I just feel like back then you care a lot about shit mm. um, that doesn't, like you care about what other people think quite a lot. Yeah. And uh, it doesn't actually matter. And I think that stopped me from doing a lot of the stuff that I'm doing now back then. Mm-hmm. Even when, even like music and stuff, like I think you try and stay in your lane too much. Yeah. I should have veered out of my lane sooner. Nice. Yeah. I like that. Thoughtful. Um, other than yourself, mm-hmm. who's your favorite musical artist right Ooh, now? Oh, yeah. Um, me. Oh, I can't say myself. Sorry. Other than yeah. Um, uh, <laughs> <laughs> you, straight away. My favorite right now mm. or in general forever? General forever. Sounds like someone in the military. <laughs> general, general forever. <laughs> Are you with General Forever know, today? General oh, forever, God. He's a nice. <laughs> Um, probably, uh, okay, not my favorite ever, but I do fucking love Queen. Yeah. I fucking love Queen. Yeah. And I think that, that because they've been played so much, they're a little bit underrated because people are like, oh, I've heard Don't Stop Me Now a million times. Yeah, yeah. They're so good. Good. Yeah. Last one. Yeah. Are you genuinely happy? Yeah. Are you doing the fucking podcast? What's his name? What? That's the last question on, uh, Diary of a CEO podcast every time. Oh, he, no, he asks what guests have asked before. Oh, right, yeah. right, right, right. Uh, yes, I am genuinely happy. Mm. There were times in the second year of lockdown where I was not. Mm. And I didn't realize at the time, because you never do. No. You're always like, oh, yeah, I'm fine. And then that was before I started TikTok. And then, because I just felt like I didn't have an outlet for anything. No one was doing everything, obviously. Everyone was in the house. But now I am happy. Good. Thanks for asking. Are no. you? It's not my episode. <laughs> okay. That's it. Sounds like I know. That's it. That was 20 questions <laughs> That's with Fred. It. Yeah. Uh, thanks very much. Um, remember to check the vote for the name of the podcast. Next time we'll be interviewing Sam Cornforth. I love it that we did me first when people kind of do already know me. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> yeah, everyone's true. just like, yeah, but who the fuck is that guy? Yeah, though? who's the nonce? Thanks. Oh, I love Bye. you. Bye.